We all know it. Walked it every day. But none of them were like these. The world's most dangerous ways to school. Freezing. Climbing for hours. Bailing non-stop. All for the chance of a better life. Spectacular and sometimes simply beautiful. The world's most dangerous ways to school. The river has changed overnight. Yesterday, it was still a safe place to cross. Now, it poses a potential hazard for 10-year-old Tuguldur and his horse. The constant thawing and refreezing causes the ice to reshape itself. Can Tuguldur trust the ice? Will the ice hold his weight? Just like the other Mongolian nomad children in the valley, Tuguldur must cross the river to get to school in Tunker. On the icy way there, the children learn valuable life lessons. The nomad girl Derga Tsitsik must also travel through the biting cold. When spring comes, everything is better. The snow melts and everything is green. The school in the village, a warm haven. Sometimes I'm afraid that the horse will buck and start running. The nomad children in Mongolia. <laughs> Theirs is one of the most dangerous ways to school in the world. Winter on the Mongolian steppe. A long and difficult time for nomadic Mongolians and their cattle. 